Welcome to the show. My guests today are curious of what is to come of their troubled relationships. Please meet Ben. Uh, he says his life is finally turning out just the way he pictured it. Ben, what's going on? Uh, Jerry, I, I, ho I recently hooked up with the girl of my dreams. Um, Wearing that um, tie? Huh? <laughs> and I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm going to be with her, but I just got to tell my girlfriend it's over. You have a girlfriend, but this other girl is the girl of your dreams? Yes. Then why'd you wind up with this girlfriend? I don't know. She was just there. Okay. Why, weren't you, why didn't it start out with the girl of your dreams? I mean, oh, because she was popular and I was in the marching band. Oh. <laughs> and so you couldn't be popular because you were in the marching band. What instrument did you play? Uh, drums. Well, that's kind of cool. Okay. So you're in the marching band. And she, what, what was she, like a cheerleader? Or? Yeah, she was captain of the cheerleader. Oh, okay. Yeah. And well, how'd you now wind up with her? I work at Family Dollar. I've been working at Family Dollar for a few months now. And you work, work where? Family Dollar. Family Dollar. Okay, yeah. yeah. And, she, and she came in last week, and I was, I was really nervous. I mean, I was sweaty, and it was just... You mean when that. you saw her, you were? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and she was walking down the aisles, and I was watching her. She shopped, and I, I didn't think she knew me, but she called me by my name, and... Did you have a, a, a name tag? Oh, no. Oh, so she was in there. Okay. And uh, she gave me tickets to the amusement park she worked at and told me to come out there and hang out with her. So I was like, okay. And uh, next day I, I went out there and uh, we, we rode rides. We hung out together and we were walking past a milk jug toss game. She <laughs> tossed her into some milk jugs yeah. and she, she pulled me back at the back of it and we started making out and we had sex. You had sex behind the milk jugs? <laughs> you can still hear the rent. You can still hear the rings hitting the milk jugs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so now you're making in love to her, and, and now you, you really, this has been, <clears throat> she was your high school dream. Oh, best sex ever. Oh, yeah. And, and, uh. Is there a lot of competition, or? <laughs> yeah. yeah, okay. And so now you're, you're having sex with her, and you really like her now. Yeah. And, and how long have you been with your current girlfriend? Uh, two years, December 2nd. Oh. Oh, and uh, yeah. we, we've been having problems anyways. I'm 19, and she's been talking about having babies and stuff. And How old is she? She's 18. Oh, okay. Right. And she's, she's been talking about marriage. And uh, you, know, you know those online websites where you take your picture and the picture of your girlfriend and make them together, and it makes pictures of babies? <laughs> well, one day I came home from work, and No, she, I don't, but go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't and, want you to think for a second. I was, yeah, go ahead. Uh, one day I came home from work and she gave me one of the pictures and it's, it's been like that every day. Every day I come home from work, she'll give me another picture and now she's framing them and putting them on the walls. I don't know how it works. Oh, there it is. <laughs> well, there you go. That's what your baby would look like. I hope not. Oh, well, that's a she. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. She became a boy just like that. Back to a girl. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I think you're smart. At this point, you don't want to have babies. You're 19, you know. So you're here to tell her what? That I don't want to be with her anymore. Now, and how much of it is because this other girl came into the picture, the cheerleader? It's 100%. It's, oh, yeah. You just, all of a sudden, you're head over heels. Not I've been head over heels uh, over since, since yeah. middle school. Since, since middle school? Yeah. Okay. Well, now, what, her name is Brittany? Yeah. She, her name is Brittany, too. Both of them are named Brittany? Yeah. <laughs> well, at least you won't yell out the wrong name. <laughs> so we're going to, who's the first Brittany we're going to meet? Who do you uh, want to meet first? Brittany P is her last initial? That's my girlfriend. That's your girlfriend. Let's meet your girlfriend, Brittany. <laughs> <laughs> This is the girl of my dreams. I mean, I've been, I've been waiting for her my whole life. But you, you haven't spent any time with her except behind the uh, milk bottles. <laughs> and it was the best sex ever, my whole life. I mean, we, we had sex standing up. I can barely pick her up. <laughs> like, I'm going to college to make it where we can have money so we can raise a family and have a better life. And you told me 
that's, that's what you wanted. You wanted me to go to college you, and make money for us so we can have everything that we wanted. It's going to be a lot of sympathy for her because, okay, but you, have, you fantasize about this other girl. How many times have you been out with her? Once. <laughs> And you haven't even sat down with her. She was standing up. <laughs> Let's meet the other Brittany. I'm, I'm so glad we had that moment at the amusement park. I, I want to be with you for the rest of my life. Seriously? I don't want to be with you. But it, what, what was that sex? What was the sex? It was just sex. It was nothing to me. I'm just happy we had it. I mean, you're a band geek. You've oh. always been a band geek. You always will be a band geek. I was a head band geek? Oh, yeah. band geek. Yeah. I was head cheerleader. I don't want to be with you. I didn't even remember your name. You were wearing a name badge, you dumbass. <laughs> See, you were. I told you you were. <laughs> it was just sex. Okay. Well, well, why did why did you why did you bother to have sex with him then? To get back at her for what she did to me. In what high did school. she do to you? She got me expelled from high school over a game of truth or dare. No, she gave a guy on the bus because you dared me to. No, because you're a whore. Well, at least I'm not a fat, ugly bitch. Fourteen-year-old girl dreams to play in Playboy. Me? <laughs> Okay. All right, this is... Okay, before we break for recess, uh, <laughs> you, uh, you're the high school cheerleader. She's doing something with a boy on the school bus. You report her, and as a result, she gets expelled. Is this right? It was gross. Nobody wanted to be on the bus while she's back there. You guy. were doing the same thing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, bad bus. Uh, and now, so in other words, you slept with him just to get back at her. Yeah. She ruined my life. I got sent to a Christian school. <laughs> Been to a Christian school. I was grounded for three months. I could only watch the Discovery Channel. Seriously. It sucked. You, we can send you tapes of the shows you missed of our show. Yeah. Uh, Okay. okay, I understand you're angry at her because you got expelled. Going to a Christian school is not a bad thing. You could have had an education there and a good one. Did it seriously not mean anything? No, it didn't. I want to be with you for the rest of my life. Well, I don't want to be with you, so start stepping because we ain't going to be together. See, she doesn't even love you. I don't. She doesn't, even, she doesn't, she doesn't want you at all, like... Okay, uh, I don't know who's advising you in life, but let's, let's start here. First of all, he's not, I'm not sure you really want to be with him. I know you're hurt now and you say you love him, but this is not a guy who's ready to be committed at all. And you say you want to spend the rest of your life with someone, seriously, that you have spent a couple of hours with. Now that is absurd. It was the best sex of my life. It doesn't matter. It's only because you haven't had a lot. It may end up being, but you don't know that at 19. One time behind milk bottles. <laughs> you're, you seem like a sweet girl. So I don't know what you're doing. And I understand you're angry, because you did get her kicked out of school. I mean, regardless of what she was doing or not, you got her kicked out of school. She's obviously angry, but you doing it this way, I'm not sure that's a good way to get your revenge. Well, he's the most important thing in her life and she took everything I had, so. So what do you want to say to her? Because she's not going to have you. No. That seems clear. I want her and I'm going to try all I can to get her. After everything like I do for you, 
You're so lazy. You don't even, I, like, I go and work so much to, like, have everything, and you just sit on your butt all day. What is it that you see about him? Honest, you know, you may be a nice guy, but... I just, I just he says the him. silly stuff. He's not committed to you. Now you're telling me he's also lazy. What is it? I don't know. I just love him. And this you're throwing away. This is crazy. You may not find someone that's going to love you that much. That's, 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 that's your decision. Man. All right. So, you want nothing to do with him. Nope. You would still like to be with him, despite this display of, even if he doesn't love you, you want to be with him. Yeah, I still want to be with him. Don't you want to be with someone who will love you? I, Why go through I, life being with someone who doesn't love you? He told me, let me promise but He me. tells anything. He's, he, he's behind the, he's not being honest with you. But I believe him and I don't know. It just, I don't get why she would do this. It's been, it was so long ago. It's done. She shouldn't have done it, but she did it. Now what? You still are in control of your life, and you're going to let him control it. He's too young. You may grow up to be a lovely young man, but right now you're making crazy decisions, and you still want to be with him. I don't know, Jerry. I just... Find someone who will love you back. <laughs> we'll be back. If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing, take care of yourself and each other.